In this video, let's talk about a AI super agent that can do nearly everything for you and I mean it. From creating full stack apps to creating short videos with perfect lip sync, doing data analysis, deep research, integrating with various third party tools or even MCP support, this AI agent has got you covered. And I'm talking about Deep Agent by Abacus AI. And in this video, I'll explain all about this super cool AI agent. So let's quickly get started. So this right here is Deep Agent, the god tiered AI agent that I've been talking about. So the first thing that you gotta do is to click the first link in the description below and you will land on this page right here. And this is where all the magic happens. So go ahead and sign up for a new account. And as you can see, it says welcome to Deep Agent. Deep Agent is a highly advanced, powerful general purpose agent designed to run and automate complex tasks. So it is capable of everything from creating websites, documents to making presentations and dashboard. There's a lot this AI agent can do. So I'll click on this check it out button right here. And now as you can see, this is the dashboard that you'll be taken to as soon as you log in. And here in the dashboard itself, you can find a couple of things this AI agent can do. It can create full stack apps. It can create short videos with perfect lip sync. It can create AI apps. It can integrate with various tools like X, Jira, Slack, Figma. It can do deep research. It can create PowerPoint presentations. It has support for browser use, do data analysis. I mean, this AI agent can do a lot of stuff. And in this video specifically, we are planning to create a AI app using Deep Agent. Yes, we are going to use a AI agent to create a AI app. And now all you're going to do is to go ahead and explain exactly what you want this AI agent to do in this input box right here and hit enter. And now it will intelligently detect what exactly you want to do and take it to a workspace according to that. So in this case, let's say I want to create an app. So all I got to do is to input the description or it's the features that I want, explain it in here and hit enter and deep agent gets to work or let's say you want to create a short video with lip sync or let's say do some deep research or anything as such you can simply go ahead and explain it in here and you should be pretty much sorted so basically i'm planning to create a ai powered travel planner app using ai so I'll go ahead and start by giving a simple prompt something like this and it says create a ai travel planner app where users can input the destination trip duration the number of people and the budget and the ai creates a detailed travel plan and itinerary so this right here is the prompt i'll give and now i'll go ahead and click on the send button right here all right so deep agent has started it works so it is going through this planning process right now it is evaluating the prompt that we just sent and now it says before I start building your AI travel planner, I need to clarify a few things. What specific features would you like in the travel plan like accommodation, suggestions, restaurant? Okay, should the app include any specific preferences uh, option for users? Do you want the app to show estimated cost? Should the users be able to save export their generated itineraries? Okay. Uh -huh. It even has built-in database and hosting support. So that is yet another cool thing. So the point here is that you can go ahead and customize the app exactly like the way you want to. So in this case, I'll just go ahead and ask the AI to choose the appropriate answers and move forward. I'll click send. And again, if you want to, let's say, upload some screenshots or some other files for reference or anything as such, you can actually click on this paperclip icon right here and attach images and files. And it will be like an additional context to the AI so that it can actually get things done way easier and also exactly like the way you want to. So if you have some files, you can go ahead and attach it in here. In which case, let's wait for the deep agent to sort of complete the initial phase. And now it says developing an AI travel planner with Gemini API integration. And now it will take some time. So let's wait till it is done. All right. So as you can see, the AI is working on building our app and it says I'll build the AI travel planner starting with a Next.js setup. And it is now creating all these files searching for some stock photos i believe and it is creating all these i mean it is generating images using ai then writing the code and the whole process will take some time so once done you'll be able to find a preview to the same towards the right side and you can even go ahead and deploy it in a couple of clicks in which ways all right so that was the image that the ai has actually generated in which ways the whole process will take some time so let's wait till it is done all right so there you go so deep agent has went ahead and created the entire site so it has run all these commands, it has generated all these files and this right here is the finished output. So maybe I can put it in full screen. Let's see. All right. So this right here is the website. So it says Wanderwise AI, craft your perfect journey with AI. And now I can find the login and sign up button towards the top. All right. So here we have the form that we need to fill to select the destination, start date, end date, number of people, total budget, travel style, dietary restrictions and even activity preferences. Right, so this right here is the app and now the first thing that I'll do is obviously I need to log in and as I can see it says it has actually created a demo account for us to test. So what I'll do is I'll click on this login button right here 
and hopefully that should take us to the login page so let's see all right so there you go and now i can put my demo account details for now but obviously if you want to let's say create a new account you can click on the sign up button but for now let me use this demo details click on sign in all right so it says signing in okay so it seems like now we are logged in and i can find an option that says my itineraries welcome john doe and next up let's just go ahead and see if it is functional so i'll put some random information like paris maybe let's say from june 30 to yeah july 5 uh, two people yeah 2000 budget mid-range mm, okay adventure maybe some relaxation and nature and wildlife i mean for paris no way right i'll do something like arts and museum history relaxation food and maybe cultural and i'll click on this generate itinerary option and now it says building your dream trip so let's see so hopefully if things work it will now show us a detailed travel plan and also store it in the database so that we can access it anytime by going over to this my itinerary section so let's wait all right so there you go it has actually created a itinerary and it says your itinerary for paris two people six days two thousand budget it has an option that says save itinerary and also option to export it as pdf so here we can find a daily schedule hotel name that is hotel ibis then breakfast activities transportation accommodation dining i mean all of this is nicely displayed in here uh, day by day and now if i go to the cost breakdown section i can find the overall cost as to how much it will cost me for this trip and if i click on the save itinerary option hopefully okay the itinerary is saved and if i click on this export pdf button okay uh, it is known functional for now i guess but the interesting thing is that if i go to my itinerary section right now hopefully i should be able to see the one that we saved so there you go so this right here is a dummy one and this one right here is the one that we generated so even after we go ahead and create a itinerary we can save it and the same is being stored in a database so that we can go ahead and access it anytime all right i know the interesting part is if you're about to build some apps using deep agent it will actually go ahead and incorporate a user authentication system and database all by its own so you don't have to rely on any third-party database provider for that option so if you click on this database option towards the top you can find all these tables within your project so in this case we have account itinerary session user and verification token and if i click on this itinerary option right here i can find all these entries in the database and again everything is already taken care of by the ai and now if i move over to this code tab right here i'll be able to view the code responsible for the same and i just went ahead and inspected the api route and all the code and it all looks really great and it actually used the abacus ai api and it is specifically using the gpt 4.1 mini model and if you want to change that you can completely do that so yeah this is how it is and now the interesting part here is that i was able to create this app in just one prompt i did not give any follow-up prompt or anything else i just went ahead and gave this prompt right here and there you go the ai has actually went ahead and created the working version of the app that we wanted so normally what happens is that it will run into some errors or it might want you know implement all the features that we want and then we will need to sort of send another message to get it working and all that but in this case deep agent has actually one shotted the entire app and it's actually a cool one it's a full stack app it has database it has login sign up functionality a form where we can submit all the details and upon clicking the generate itinerary button it creates the itineraries and even stores the same in the database and we can find that in the my itinerary section right here and now let's say you want to make some changes or let's say you want to add even more features or do anything as such you can simply go ahead and input that in here hit enter and you can take it that way and if you click on this button right here you can check your website for responsiveness so as you can see our website is 100% mobile responsive and now here comes the most important part and that is you have the option to deploy and make the site live in just a single click and yes you heard it correct so normally after people generate or let's say create all these websites or apps using AI, they're confused as to how to make it live. Well, if you're about to use Deep Agent, towards the top right, you can find an option that says deploy. So if I click on this button right here, it says deploy to production. And now I can go ahead and give it a deployment name. So in this case, I'll go ahead and say Wanderwise. I know you have two options. You can either deploy it to the subdomain of Abacus AI.app, or if you have a custom domain, you can add the same in the settings and select it from here and take it that way as well. So in this case, I'll just uh, for the time being uh, deploy the same as a subdomain of this particular domain, and I can click on this deploy button. All right. So deployment successful. Please wait for one minute for the app to come live. 
and now the interesting part is so far we actually used the app within this interface right here within deep agent right now what happens is that if i go ahead and copy this url and put that in a new tab and hit enter pretty much anyone will be able to access the website that means we have went ahead and created an app and deployed it so that it is live on the internet and i can now share this link right here with anyone and anyone can create an account and start using the app right away how interesting right so this is basically how you create a app using deep agent so in this case the ai was able to one shot the app in just a single prompt but if you want to make any changes add new features or do anything as such you can take it up from here now i'll quickly head back to the dashboard and if you go through the dashboard you'll quickly realize that you can do even more things using deep agent for example we can create videos we can integrate with various third party you know services do deep research and all that so before i wind up the video i'll also show you how you can sort of create a short video using ai so for example let's say if i click on this let's say example right here i can find a prompt in here like an example prompt and you can also find a tutorial as to how to use that in here as well okay in which ways let's just go ahead and give a prompt something similar to this one so the default prompt says that can you make a lip sync video about cartoon professor explaining theory of relativity and now instead i'll just go ahead and modify it to something else so this right here is the modified prompt that i'll give and it says can you make a lip sync video of a young lady baking a cake in the kitchen and now i can click on the send button right here i just wanted to show all the options that you have within deep agent so if you want to let's say create a video you totally have the option for that and now it is asking us to clarify a few details like the duration the quality the platform to which you want to post the image stills and all that i'll go ahead and say choose the appropriate answers and move forward but you have total control over the aspect ratio the quality duration content and everything else let's just see what it comes up with let's wait all right so there you go the ai has went ahead and created a full 29.21 seconds long video and here you have the output and now let me go ahead and play it for you hey everyone Today I'm sharing my secret to the fluffiest vanilla cake ever. The key? Room temperature ingredients and don't overmix. First, cream your butter and sugar until it's light and fluffy. Then add eggs one at a time. Now here's the magic. Alternate between dry ingredients and milk, starting and ending with flour. Mix just until combined. This is actually sick. So normally what happens is that when you go ahead and ask the AI to sort of create a video, it just goes ahead and creates a video of like 5 seconds or 10 seconds so in this case the ai has went ahead and created a full 30 seconds long video and you can actually go ahead and download it using this link right here so that's basically all about it so here we have downloaded the same so yeah that's pretty much all i wanted to show you about deep agent so deep agent is like a super ai agent that can do a lot of stuff for you like creating full stack apps creating short videos integrating with various third party apps has mcp support create powerpoint do deep research and data analysis and there's a lot this deep agent can do so if you want to quickly get started the first thing that you got to do is to click the first link in the description below go ahead and sign up for a new account and you can start using it right away so i hope you guys found this video useful if yes make sure to subscribe and i'll see you next one